Hello everyone, welcome back to the VOC Training Academy. My name is Ray, and today I'm going to walk you through how to integrate the VOC AI chatbot into your Shopify store. Alifris Art is my personal e-commerce brand, and I'm going to demonstrate this process using my own Shopify store. I'm incredibly excited to integrate the AI chatbot into my Shopify store because it's about to get a serious upgrade in customer service. I'm going to take you through the setup process in four simple steps. Each step comes with clear instructions. I suggest that you watch this video twice, once to grasp the process and the second time to follow along as we set up. Pause this video when you need to and we will make sure the AI chatbot is perfectly tuned to your needs. Let's jump right into it. So first I'm going to go onto the Shulex website and log into my account. The dashboard that you're going to see when you log in and I'm going to click the AI chatbot right here. I'm using a free trial and we're going to start right here in settings. So this interface is where you customize the visuals for your chatbot that you want it to appear on your Shopify store. So I'm going to set a name for my bot, which is called Alifris Art. My industry is in e-commerce, but here's the drop down menu and you can pick your industry. And this is going to be your welcome message. So if you see this right here, this message is customizable. So I'm going to type right here, hello. How can we help you today? That's going to be my message. And here you can set your brand colors so that it matches the color palette of your Shopify store. You can either select from this gradient here or I'm going to type in the hex code for the colors that I want for my brand. So as you can see, I've typed in the two colors for my brand and this chatbot has changed into the colors that I want it to be. Here is where you can upload a brand logo or an image if you would like, and it will appear right here in the chatbot. So I have uploaded this image and it will show up when I refresh the page. This is where you can customize the message that your clients will see when this chat is being transferred to an agent. So I'm going to say, please wait for a member of our staff to get back to you ASAP. Thank you for your patience. And you can type any message here that you would like. Now we're on to step two, upload your knowledge. So there are two ways that you can upload your knowledge or website content into the AI chatbot. The most simple way that I recommend you do is to import content from a URL. So if I go into my website right here, this is Alifris Arts, the website for my personal e-commerce brand. And I'm mainly going to select the pages that contain information that describes the brand. So perhaps the about page. This page has some information about the brand, what we do, our promise, the founder, myself. And so this text is what the AI is going to pull from in order to answer the customer questions that come in through the chatbot. So I'm going to copy this. Import website content paste the URL there and if you have a frequently asked questions tab that would be a great place as well to copy paste some content so I can copy that paste it in here and I might also copy the URL for my product page that has some descriptions about what the product is so I'm selling 48 color oil pastels and here is a little description that it has and the AI will be able to pick up that description and learn from it. Perfect. So I'm going to click sync website content. As you can see, the page has refreshed. So the colors that I input it here for my brand colors are going to appear on the chatbot um, as well as this logo that I uploaded will appear right here. Now I'm going to click save on the upper right hand right here. On to step three, I'm going to go to the knowledge tab. And here you can see the three URLs that I pasted from my website and the status of the upload. This usually takes about one minute, but that was about 15 seconds. So it's really quick. So we're going to go to the publish tab right here. Click on live chat. And this is the code that you're going to embed into your Shopify store. So I'm just going to copy go into your Shopify store, log in. Now I'm logged into my Shopify store and you're going to click on online store right here. 
And under themes, there are three dots that you can click right here and click on edit code. I know there's a lot of codes on the left hand side here. Don't worry. You're going to click on theme.liquid. I know this page is overwhelming because there's so much code, but don't feel overwhelmed because we're just pasting. So scroll all the way down to the very bottom where you see HTML. That's the very last line. And then you can see body right here. And we're going to paste the code right on the line above where it says body right here. So make sure you scroll all the way down to the very bottom of the code and make sure you are on the right tab that says theme.liquid. So right above body, I'm going to make a new line right here and I'm going to command V, paste the code in here and click save on the upper right hand right here. Now the VOC AI chatbot has been embedded into your Shopify store. We are almost done unless you still have a Shopify chatbot that you have set up previously. And I'm going to show you right now how to disable that so there are not two chatbots overlapping on top of each other. So I'm just going to exit, going to go to inbox right here. It says online store chat is on. So if yours says off, don't worry about it. If yours says on, we're going to disable it. Click on manage settings. And where it says online for chat on, we're going to click turn off. So now it says chat has been updated. It may take a few minutes for it to appear or disappear on your store. So I'm going to go to my website right now and refresh it. And I know this is the AI chatbot because this is the message that I wrote and the same brand colors that I put in. So now my customers can get instant responses 24 seven. Let's test it out. I'm going to type in my email in order to send a message. And here's the greeting message that we wrote. Hi, what can I help you with? Let's ask a simple question. What does Eliphras Art sell? So Eliphras Art is a brand focused on manufacturing professional art supplies. And here is the response. And that's it. It only took four simple steps to embed the AI chatbot into my Shopify store. But that is not the only platform that it can be integrated in. The VOC AI chatbot also supports platforms such as Amazon, Zendesk, Intercom, email, WhatsApp, and so much more. And there you have it. That was the power of the VOC AI chatbot. If you are ready to elevate your customer service game, click the link in the description below to start your free trial. If you enjoyed this video, hit that like button, subscribe for more e-commerce content, and I'll see you in part two where I show you how to customize the AI responses and track the efficiency of the chatbot that you have just embedded into your Shopify store. My name is Ray and I'll see you in the next video.